like somebody's playing with a drill inside my skull. You sure this is the place? It's the address in the report. Right. Okay. Let's get going. Sexiest androids in town. Now I know why you insisted on coming here. By the way, Gavin's in there, too. Oh, great. Dead body and an asshole, just what I needed. Lieutenant Anderson and his plastic pet. The fuck are you two doing here? We've been assigned all cases involving androids. Oh, yeah? I'm like wasting time. There's some pervert who, uh... <laughs> <laughs> Got more action than he could handle. <laughs> we'll have a look anyway, if you don't mind. <laughs> Come on, let's go. It's uh, starting to stink of booze in here. Night, Lieutenant. You're so disgusting. I think I'm gonna puke again. Die of a heart attack. He was strangled. Yeah, I saw the bruising on the neck. That didn't prove anything, though. Could have been a rough play. The only way to access its memory is to reactivate it. Think you can do it? It's badly damaged. If I can, it'll only be for a minute, maybe less. I just hope it's long enough to learn something. reactivated you. Everything is all right. Is he... Is he dead? Tell me what happened. He started... hitting me. 
Again. And again. Did you kill him? No. No, it wasn't me. Were you alone in the room? Was there anyone else with you? He wanted us to play with two girls. That's what he said, there was two of us. What model was the other android? Did it look like you? So there was another android. This happened over an hour ago. It's probably long gone. No. It couldn't go outside dressed like that unnoticed. It might still be here. If you could find a deviant among all the other androids in this place. Deviants aren't easily detected. Oh, shit. There's got to be some other way. Maybe an eyewitness, somebody who saw it leaving the room. I'm going to go ask the manager a few questions about what he saw. You let me know if you think of anything. Something? Maybe. Can you rent this, Tracy? For fuck's sake, Connor, we got better things to do. Please, Lieutenant. Just trust me. Good on my expense account. Purchase confirmed. Eden Club wishes you a pleasant experience. You're welcome. Delighted to meet you. Follow me. I'll take you to your room. Okay, now what? It saw something. What are you talking about? Saw what? The Deviant leave the room. A blue-haired Tracy. Club policy is to wipe the android's memory every two hours. We only have a few minutes if we want to find another witness. Let's try this one. This better be a I saw the blue-haired Tracy. I know which way it went. Then go for it. There are androids everywhere. How are you gonna tell which one saw the Tracy with blue hair? I know which
I know where it went. Follow me. Oh, fucking A. This is crazy. Wait. I'll take it from here. Shit. We're too late. Look at them. They get used till they break and then they get tossed out. had nothing to do with any of this. <sighs> when that man killed that Tracy, I knew I was next. I was so scared. <sighs> I begged him to stop, but he wouldn't. So I put my hands around his throat and I squeezed until he stopped moving. Yes, I killed him. 
but I was just defending myself. I wanted to live. I wanted to get back to the one I love. Forget about the humans, the smell of their sweat and their dirty words. But you, you've taken her away from me. I love her. I loved her. These people we're going to see. How do you know about them? Overheard androids not go captured. They said they were humans helping androids across the border. What if it was a lie? Or just another trap? All I know is those androids believed it. Until Zlatko killed them. Good things Lako had a car. I wouldn't want Ellis out walking in this cold. I saw it once in the garage. I don't know if Zako even ever used it. The AX400 android reported to have attacked its owner in a Detroit suburb is still at large. Police appeared to lose its trail after a close encounter. The Arctic conflict has escalated to new heights. Malfunction detected. Emergency brakes activated. This doesn't look good. Stay inside, Alice. Do. I don't know. Continue on foot, I guess. It's 30 degrees. Alice won't make it. We have to find somewhere to spend the night. There's nowhere we can stay around here, Carol. shelter. We have to get out of the cold. Looks like it's been abandoned for a while. Welcome to Pirate Island, me hearties. You're gonna have a whale of a time. Welcome to Pirate Island, me hearties. You're gonna have a whale of a time.
I'll handle this. Here we go. anything better. Let's settle in for the night. I'll get a fire going. I'll make the fire here. That way we won't be smoked out. Find a job. We'll be like them. Like everyone else. As long as we're together, that's all that matters. Come on. Let's get you to bed. stories in memory. I should have one for you. This is a story about a princess who... No, not a story like that. Make one up for me. This is a story about a little girl who lived alone in a big old house. She dreamed of being like all the other little girls, but the shadow that lived within her kept her from being happy. Then she met a robot who was just as lost as the little girl. So they decided to run away together. Try to find a better life. They encountered great dangers along the way, but... But they stuck together. So they overcame all of them. Along the way, they met... Another robot. Who left his master to become their guardian. How does the story end? 
reach the place they dream of and live happily ever after. Stories always have happy endings, but real life isn't like that. Time to sleep. We have another long day ahead of us tomorrow. Are you going to come say goodnight, Luther? Yes. Yes, of course. thought about it. I've never been free before. Free? <laughs> I like the sound of it. But I don't know what it really means yet. It's still snowing. You have a long walk tomorrow. We better leave early if we want to avoid being seen. Kara, have you ever... Noticed anything about Alice? No, what are you talking about? Jerry, we were working here before the park closed. We didn't mean to frighten you, but sometimes humans come to hurt us, so we wanted to see who was there. What are you doing here? We were looking for shelter for the night. We'll be gone tomorrow. A little girl. We haven't seen one for a long time. Children used to love to come and see us. She looks sad. The last few days have been difficult. We have something to show her. Something fun. She'll love it. Does she want to see? Oh, I don't think she's in... Well, she should follow us, then. Alice, I don't know if it's a good Come idea. Come on, Kara. I don't think you have any choice. Be our guest! The little one can climb on board. The carousel is about to begin!
first time I've seen her smile. She hasn't had much to smile about lately. 